just a month after San Antonio police officer Ernesto Vasquez was hit by a car. The person detectives believe is responsible has now been arrested. Brand new details surfacing in that hit and run crash involving SAPD officer Ernesto Vasquez's wife. She has been detained while he remains in a coma. Courtney Friedman has been following the story, joins us live now from police headquarters. Courtney. 26 year old Diana Lopez was arrested today in Laredo and is being interviewed by detectives right now. Today, I was also able to pull this affidavit for arrest warrant, which is loaded with pages and pages of details. Lopez has been charged with failure to stop and render aid after police say she hit her husband with their family car and took off without helping him. What we found through this affidavit is that witnesses saw her there at the scene that night of the accident. Police say on New Year's Eve, eight-year police veteran Officer Ernesto Vasquez was off duty. They say he was walking across the street in the 12,600 block of Blanco Road around 11 p.m. when he was hit by an SUV. He was hospitalized and slipped into a coma. Several witnesses there say a young woman did approach Vasquez after he was hit and said that that was her husband, Ernie. They say she was very upset and was crying, but they told police it was strange. She immediately knew off the bat that it was her husband who was hit before she even got close up to him. They say she never called 911, but returned to her SUV and took off before police even got there. Chief William McManus told us today police found Lopez in Laredo on January 6th and searched her car and interviewed her. The witnesses say that her car had minor front end damage, and that is what detectives found when they saw the damage themselves. Now, when interviewing Lopez, detectives said her story was inconsistent with surveillance video they found from the Walmart across the street. She denied hitting him, but since then, police have been able to build a case against her. The matter of talking with, with witnesses to, to determine, you know, who was involved and where she was, and we had probable cause based on forensic evidence uh, and witness statements that led us to her down in Laredo. Now, the arrest warrant says that Diana Lopez has been married to Officer Vasquez for four years, but she told police herself that the relationship has always been on and off. She said they were arguing that night of the accident, and she decided to leave him, but she returned to the apartment to apologize, and that's when she said she saw him lying on the ground. Lopez also told police she never came to see her husband in the hospital, even though he was in a coma, because he didn't treat her well, and also because his family didn't like her and probably didn't want her there. Now, once Lopez is magistrated in Laredo, she will be brought here to Bear County, and there will be a bond set for her. Now, also, meanwhile, Vasquez is still in a long-term rehab facility, and he is still, we're told, in a coma-like state. For now, we're live from the police department. Courtney Friedman, KSAT 12 News. Back to